The Shift Residences is a permanent supportive housing project. Uh, it consists of 96 studio units. They're about 300 square feet and they're designed to give people a sort of a first housing option. The idea here was to incorporate a very good location but in a place where there had been a public housing experiment that hadn't turned out the way people had hoped. Around here one time it was it was bad you couldn't walk the streets. So this location is on the near north side in the middle of the Cabrini Green redevelopment area. Mercy Housing Lakefront went one step further from our initial vision and decided to hire a world-class architect, Helmut Jan, to really give this corner, this building, a presence. I saw this was an interesting challenge. The interesting challenge was to prove that a project like this doesn't have to be of a lower quality, that it can contribute to the life of the users and it can also contribute to the city. Creating a healthy building was one of the important steps in the, in the integrated design to put this building together. Here, everything is filtered, the air is clean. Even the windows, they regulate sun that we get. It's nice. We brought in two forms of alternative energy. Um, one, the wind turbines on the roof. They generate electricity, which supplements the current needed for the uh, common area lighting in the building. Also on the roof are solar thermal panels, which convert sun to heat. And that is then used to supplement the domestic hot water needs of the building. This is an incredibly energy efficient building and if you have an energy efficient base to start with, then by putting renewable energy into the building, you obviously create even a cleaner energy building. We have a rainwater harvesting system where the water does not permeate the ground, is collected in a cistern downstairs. That water is then recycled to irrigate the landscaping we've put in. Um, there's also the first instance in Chicago of a gray water system. This reduces our clean water demand in half. This is something that can be replicated elsewhere. It is so important to build a building, an affordable housing building, where the operating costs there, there can be held at a level that is manageable. Affordable housing does not have to be synonymous with substandard housing. Nice affordable housing with the support of peace in place can definitely make a difference in residents' lives. And that's where it's more than a roof because residents can come down here and get the help that they need to get back into the workforce, to go back to school, and to and just improve their quality of life. We say in the design field our, our goal is to improve the quality of people's lives, but it's really, in a, in a project like this, you can really see that it did make a difference. The Home Depot Foundation Award of Excellence, if awarded to this building, will demonstrate to other for-profit and not-for-profit developers that there is support for this type of project. Sending the message to the city, to the country, that people who are starting over deserve great architecture as well. There's a place for everybody in our city, and certainly this building conveys that. <laughs>